As soon as SpaceX Dragon Freedom capsule successfully splashed down off the Florida coast near Tallahassee, space enthusiasts and the entire world rejoiced as it finally brought Sunita Williams along with other NASA astronauts back to Earth. They had been stranded in space for around 286 days. Although her stay was not the longest as astronauts have spent way more time in space, it was the longest ever unscheduled stay in the International Space Station. In this video, we will explain why Sunita was stuck in space for such a long duration and the praise she is getting after successfully making it back to Earth. Sunita and her companion Butch Wilmore traveled to the International Space Station in June last year. They were supposed to return within a week, but their spacecraft, which had taken them there, developed problems after which it was considered unsafe for the astronauts return. This then left both astronauts stranded in space for an indefinite period. However, on Wednesday, both of them finally returned to Earth. Their return filled the space community as well as the common people with joy and many, including in India, praised Sunita's safe return to Earth. Sunita has roots in India and in her ancestral village of Julasan in Gujarat, residents were filled with joy as her spacecraft splashed into the Atlantic. Her safe return brought excitement and pride to her ancestral village. Villagers had been praying for Sunita's safe return and gathered at a temple to watch the landing live on television. The moment she arrived safely, they expressed their happiness by bursting firecrackers, dancing and chanting Har Har Mahadev. Isro wrote on X, Welcome back Sunita Williams, terming her return a remarkable event. Prime Minister Narendra Modi also welcomed Sunita's return to Earth. He wrote on X, Welcome back Crew 9. The Earth missed you. He appreciated her efforts and said there has been a test of great courage and the boundless human spirit. Sunita is considered an icon for space enthusiasts in India and many look up to her as a source of inspiration and motivation. Even Prime Minister Narendra Modi has time and again lauded Sunita's achievements in the space sector. Prime Minister Modi had also written a heartfelt letter to Sunita Williams inviting her to visit India. He wrote, even though you are thousands of miles away, you continue to remain close to our hearts. The people of India are praying for your good health and success in your mission. While she was stuck in space, PM Modi also inquired about her well-being and he even mentioned this during his meetings with US President Donald Trump and ex-President Joe Biden. This underscores India's admiration for her work. Among the dignitaries who celebrated Sunita's return includes Defense Minister Rajnath Singh, who congratulated all stakeholders involved in safely returning the standard NASA astronauts to Earth. Singh wrote, delighted at the safe return of NASA's Crew-9 on Earth. Union Minister Jitender Singh said a moment of glory, pride and relief. Former ISRO chief Dr. G. Madhavan Nair said, Sunita's return to Earth is a proud moment for the space community. Apart from this, for the global space community, Sunita's unscheduled stay in space has come with a learning lesson. Experts view this as a blessing in disguise as this could be very useful in NASA's ongoing study to assess the response of human bodies to long stays in space. Sunita and her companion had not trained to spend so much time at the ISS and their bodies might have reacted differently compared to others who prepared sufficiently for extended stays. They will now be spending next 40 days in rehabilitation programs which is designed to help astronauts recover from the physical effects of space flights. The world today is planning for more manned missions in future and Sunita can provide an opportunity for researchers to also study the mental and psychological impacts of being stranded in space when their return to Earth is uncertain.